All right, you guys, welcome to the scope. This is going to be the new format here for our uh, team builds. Instead of sitting here watching the entire gameplay, it can be a little bit boring at times. I'm going to bring you highlights. We're going to do this kind of like a uh, kind of like a news segment kind of thing, but uh, we'll see how we do here with it. Um, you'll see over here to my right hand side, we've got some stats from games one and two of the series so far. Brett Phillips has done great so far, so has Ken Griffith Sr. Um, we've got some guys who've done really well. We've got some guys who have struggled. Uh, well, up into game three here, let's check out some highlights, see how we did. So we have Brett Phillips extending his hot streak here with base hit up the middle. Uh, after that, not too much going on in first inning. Max Scherzer coming through, getting some K's right off the bat, getting some punch outs. Ken Griffey Sr. Again, just like Brett Phillips, dominating, hitting the ball hard every single at bat. Now Dexter Fowler gives a big ride here out to the outfield. Unfortunately, it does get cut in that inning. Scherzer keeps on trucking. Two strikeouts there in the inning and a third looking. Scherzer on fire. Boom, four and five. It just keeps going, man. Scherzer was looking good. We get a walk here by Rendon to lead off the inning in the fourth. We got Molina coming up, the next batter with the base hit up the middle. We got runners on first and second. Ken Griffey Sr. at the plate, he strikes out. The guy you want doesn't get it done. And Scherzer gives up a hit here to Luis Gonzalez on an up and in fastball, but he follows it up with a strikeout up and in looking. Now our spot here in this one. The guy gives it a good ride there with Eduardo Escobar, but Dexter Fowler out there has the speed to run it down. Bottom of the half inning there, we didn't do too much anything, so we are back at it on defense. We get a strikeout and then tragedy strikes. Home run given up on a cutter up and away in the zone. And a little blooper here. Pulled into left field on a cutter low and away in the zone. The cutter was kind of hurting us there for a little bit. We do get a strikeout and a ground ball to get out of the fifth inning, though. We come up, Brett Phillips back up, and another hit up the middle. Brett Phillips, absolute stud. Anthony Rendon gives this one a ride on a slider low and away. We had good PCI and time, a lot of in this game, just nothing going our way. Jim Tomey grounding out to end the sixth inning. We get a ground ball here to second base, and it's an error. Eats up Rod Carew. Gets through him. We do get another fly out here to center field, though. Runner on base. You get a fly out here to right field. We got two outs. Runner on. Are we going to get out of this without giving up a run? Ground ball to first base. We get out of it. The error doesn't hurt us. Ken Griffey Sr. up to bat. Another laser up the middle. We were on top of the ball all damn game. Hit after hit. He gets a double there. Looking good, man. Not much happening else, though, in that inning, so we do fast forward. Wade Davis is in. Fastball up and away gets him. And we get a ground ball here on a sinker inside. Rod Carew is there, though, playing with the shift. Gets him out. Looking good. And we get him to chase on a slider low and away in the zone. Wade Davis looking pretty solid. And we got Goriel coming up. He gets a hold of one. Hits it up the middle. He gets a double out of this. Cedric Mullins in center field. We exploit it all game long. We come up now. Brett Phillips is back up. Runner in scoring position. One out. Gives this one a good ride. But it is to the left fielder. He is out. Nothing going on there. Rendon goes down looking for strike three to end that inning. Bottom of the eighth was uneventful, so we're in the ninth. We get two back-to-back -back sings to lead off the ninth inning. Griffey Sr. comes up, I chase one, but here we go. Dexter Fowler gets a base hit in the middle. We've got Jim Tomey running around the bases, Cedric Mullins in the outfield. We score a run, we are tied one to one in the ninth inning. Holy hell. Now let's go back and listen to that one while it happened live. Dexter Fowler coming up big. Jim Tomey doesn't have the speed. It's Cedric Mullins. I'm fucking going for it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god, Dexter Fowler coming up big. Jim Tomey, like a fucking tank running around those bases. So we're back. We get a pass ball here. I try to send the runners back here. I get absolutely pissed off because nobody goes back. They keep going forward. Somehow that happens. We run ourselves out of the damn inning. Ninth inning is over. 
We are into the bottom of the ninth now, though. We get a strikeout looking here with Tyler Matzik. We walk the next guy, get a strikeout up in the zone here. Two down the ninth inning. I bring in Steve Sheck. Got to get us out. Strike three, swinging. C-Shack gets us out of it. We do nothing in the top of the 10th. He's back out there. C-Shack with a good, nice little play here. Keeps us tied in the game. Gets two strikeouts there in that inning as well. 10th inning, just like the, uh, the ninth inning, we don't do too much. So we jump ahead again to the bottom of the 11th inning where he hits a uh, sharp ground ball to second base, which advances the runner. So I walk. Uh, Luis Gonzalez intentionally to set up a double play. We get a double play ball here. For some reason, I tried to go to first base instead of second. I fucked up. We lose the game horrendously. I was absolutely devastated. I fucking hated it. Good God, not a way to end the damn game. Man, I tell you guys, that was a heartbreaker. I felt like I was dominating the entire game. I never felt overmatched. Um, had him up to 80 pitches in like sixth inning. I was watching pitches. I saw the ball well. Had a couple walks. Had a bunch of 3-1 counts, 3-0 counts. Things just didn't go my way. I uh, can't say anything else other than that. Kept making a couple stupid decisions, which really hurt. But, you know, it happened. Overall, though, not too shabby. We had a couple guys with multi-hits in that game. We had uh, Brett Phillips. He had two hits. Yadi Molina had two hits. And Ken Griffey Sr. continued his dominance with two hits. Um, Ken Griffey Sr. and uh, Brett Phillips have truly been dominant in this series so far. Hit after hit after hit. If you guys enjoyed this new uh, the new setup, let me know. I'd like some feedback. What do you guys like about it? What don't you like about it? I'll adjust it here as we go, but let me know. Give me some feedback down below. If you enjoyed it at all, hit that like, hit that subscribe button. I do appreciate it. I spent a lot of time. Uh, I spent quite a bit of time. I will buy um, getting this video set up. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you want any changes. I can uh, try to accommodate those. I'll see you next time. Have a good evening.